An interesting thing happened to me last week when I told people that I was going to be taking a few pounds off of my body. Uh, most of them laughed at me because I'm a kind of a skinny guy and why do I need to lose any weight? That's just ridiculous, right? But the difference is that I don't really necessarily want to lose weight, I want to lose volume. And I want to do it in a healthy, respectful way to my own mentality. It's not some body image issue, it's a literal physical discomfort that I have with my body. I recently watched a video on Shay Carl's Shay Loss channel about how he had lost about a hundred pounds over the past year and uh, he talked about this very specifically and he said you know there's a lot of people that tell me oh you don't need to lose weight blah 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 and he's like look it's a physical comfort thing and I really wanted to lose the weight and I feel exactly the same way. I've never been in this position where I feel like I need to lose weight or like volume or whatever I need to get healthy um, but I've been in the other position where I've told people, oh, you look fine, you don't need to do that. And it's made me reevaluate that whole feel comfortable in your own body thing. I'm all about being comfortable in your own body and feeling beautiful no matter how splotchy your skin is or how big your thighs are or, or how easy it is for you to get blown away in a hurricane because you weigh 40 pounds. What I'm beginning to question is the idea that we always tell people they look beautiful no matter what and so they don't need to change and therefore they shouldn't change. So we stop encouraging them to do something that they feel is going to make them feel better either mentally or physically or just all around better. I've never been on the receiving end of the you don't have to change you look beautiful as it is thing because I've always been kind of a skinny guy but being on that end of it kind of sucks. I was a little weirded out that none of my friends were being exceptionally encouraging to me. As I said I'm all in support of the idea of feeling beautiful no matter how you look but if you don't feel beautiful that I'm always in support of you changing and making the choice to do something different. It's a complex issue because sometimes people feel bad about the way they look because there is an emotional problem and not necessarily a physical one. For example, anorexics, bulimics, people with eating disorders, that kind of thing. There's a, there's a mental problem that is happening and therefore causing them to feel bad about their physical body. But a mentally healthy person that just wants to feel better about their body, like me, I just want to feel more physically comfortable in my body personal being. I don't care how people view me. I just want to feel more comfortable in my body. My bones hurt and that's a problem. And so it's a complex issue because you're not sure which version of the person's desire there is. If it's really an emotional desire or if it's a physical discomfort desire or what. But I'm telling you that it's a physical comfort desire for me that I'm uncomfortable in my body and I just want to feel more comfortable. And so I'm going to start riding my bike more and I'm going to stop drinking as much soda and I'm going to start drinking more water and eating slightly more healthy things because I want to be healthy. I don't necessarily even want to lose weight. I'm fine with how much I weigh. It's how much there's mass, there's volume on my thighs that rub together and it's, it sucks, it's uncomfortable. So I'm going to lose it. I'm going to take it off, whether you like it or not. So again, let me know in the comments what your New Year's resolution is. And if you've ever been the victim or the perpetrator of this sort of, you don't have to f change, you can feel beautiful idea and what you thought of that and how it made you feel. Anyway, that's it. I don't know how to end this video. I tried a couple of different uh, takes so maybe in editing it'll come out but anyway uh, thank you all for sticking around and and uh, thank you to all the new subscribers that came just today just this morning uh, I'm pretty excited about that thank you uh, for sticking around and uh, hopefully it'll be a good year Yay, bye.